What's up, it's you guys, and here, and today we're going to teach you how to do fractions on the ti 3 x 2 calculator. Now, hopefully you guys haven't seen my other videos about how can you do exponents on the calculator. So, so we're entering, alright, so we're going to enter a different fraction. All we can do is enter 8 and 3 fourths, so we're going to put 8, 3, 4. So... What if you do is press 8 and press the little ABC button, which gives you this right here. You can focus, focus, all right. And enter in 3, 4. And once when you've done that, it will show this instead of a fraction bar. So once when you simplify it, once when you, well, you, can, you can't simplify a fraction that's like 3 fourths. And you get... 8 and 3 fourths. So, as you can see, as you can see right here, 8 and 3 4. So, we're going to do a little bit harder one. We're going to do 50 and 9 twelfths. So, 50 and 9 twelfths. So, all you have to do is enter in 50 and then 9 and press the ABC button. Now the ABC button is worth this one, so you know what I'm talking about. It's right here. You guys can see 50 over 9, and you can't also lift the thing behind. So we're gonna enter in 1, 2. So 50 9 twelfths. You simplify that, you get 50 and 3 fourths. Now you can't possibly 50, 50 and 9 twelfths. All you have to do is divide it by 1. And you get 3, 4. And it's easy. And we're going to have to show you about why can you do fractions on a TI3X2S calculator. So we have the, the 50 and 9 twelfths button right here. And so we're going to be showing you how to do fractions with exponents on a calculator. So we're going to enter in 8 and use the exponent button. This is right here. Sorry. It's right here. We're gonna enter in. We're gonna enter in ninety-eight over four. Ninety-eight over four. Sorry about that, guys. And you get and it, and you see the little exponent right there. Sorry, you guys can see these things. See the exponent right there. You can see. You get 1.33568694.5 times 10 to the 22nd power. So, so if you want to do this, if you can divide, if you can divide by 10, you get this answer here. It's basically simple, except for that one. So, hopefully you guys enjoyed my video. As always, comment, like, subscribe, share. Let me know what you think about ti 3 x 2 us What videos should I make next? As always, stay tuned for more videos. As always... Peace out.